It's a carefully choreographed sequence of events when medical professionals gear up to confront COVID-19. Gowns, gloves, and masks all worn to protect themselves from infection while treating those in need. Tonight, one nurse is sharing her account while being on the front lines. Initially, it's like it scares me, but over the course, you know, I, you know, this this that's my job, so you know, I have to do it. Maria Ramirez has been working as a nurse for 25 years and says she has experienced dealing with infectious diseases. I've been exposed to uh, like tuberculosis or influenza or uh, chicken pox in the back. She started overseas and is now using her skills at a hospital in San Antonio, caring for a patient she says tested positive for COVID-19. I don't want to catch it and then um, spread it to my family because I have also kids and spread it to my kids. Ramirez wears a gown, gloves, a mask and face shield over her scrubs, all placed strategically to keep the virus away. The like steps you have to follow of how you put it on and also how you take it off. Ramirez works three nights a week. She says she sometimes goes through seven or eight gowns, gloves and masks a night. She also makes it a point to disinfect her clothes and bleach her shoes. The challenges that we're facing, I think it's you know, it's a worldwide, like there's a shortage of uh, supplies of um, gowns and masks and the shields. Ramita says she is taking vitamins and makes sure to get enough sleep to keep up her immunity. She is only one nurse in a round of shifts taking care of the patient.